So all that little stuff like tie downs and connectors, just go with the count on the invoice. They're almost never wrong. What about these wireless cards? Count them. Is that the new 600? Yeah, it looks like it. There should be uh, 25 of them here. Cool. Let me see one. Just put down 24. What else is in there? Uh, uh, there's some flash drives and sound cards. Is that okay? Aren't they going to miss that? Don't worry about it. Just change it to 24. <laughs> Look, this is what, your third day here? Tell me this. How am I supposed to recommend a product I've never even used? Well, I, I don't know. I'm... Of course you don't, because it's not possible. <laughs> but if I take this home, start using it, then I can honestly tell our customers this is the best wireless card we have to offer. Get it? Well, I'm... <laughs> What's up, guys? Hey, how's the newbie doing? Uh, not so good. Uh, we were just going over our little product testing plan, and he doesn't seem to be grasping the concept. What's the grasp, kid? Getting free stuff is one of the main reasons I still work here. But... but doesn't it seem like stealing to you guys? Oh! Stealing? From who? If you change it to 24, the store gets a free replacement. The distributor charges it back to the manufacturer. And the manufacturer comes out ahead because when we tell customers we use these things at home, they sell more. Everybody wins. I guess I never really thought of it that way. Trust me. I've been doing this a long time. Just change it to 24. Okay. So, it is my third day on the job, and I don't know all the company's policies yet, but... A product testing plan that requires us to change the invoice? This sounds like a moment of truth to me.